What's up, y'all? I'm Takesha LaFay. Let me get a little bit more light. And today is Sunday, September 4th. Wait. Can y'all see? Beyonce's birthday at 4.47 a.m. And y'all gonna be getting out work with me today. Right now, I'm in Malvern, Malvern, Arkansas. I have to get to Memphis to get off work. Yeah. Um, I want to show y'all what a 34 hour break looks like. So yeah, this is y'all go ride with me to get off work and what I do when I'm off work. So I just made it to my company's um, drop lot here in Memphis and the time now is 8.06 and it's still Beyonce birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday Beyonce. <laughs> Yeah, I'm tired, so I'm gonna have to um sit here, get my thoughts together before I drive to my job, which is 30 minutes away, in which I had to pass to get here. And um, I don't know, I'm staying the same. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna just sit here, get my thoughts together, see what all I gotta do when I make it over there. I hate this shit. I'll be glad when I look back at these videos and just, I'm probably gonna start crying because I know how I felt in this moment. Like, it's just so much. It's too much. Way too much. I really feel like truckers do not get paid enough to be dealing with this. This is horrible. I really need to go ahead and post. Man, I got so much stuff I need to do. I really just want to go home and mop my floors, eat my tacos, and watch Death of a Cheerleader. But I got to edit this video. Well, I got to finish filming, first of all. I like my hair. People be on Snapchat talking about my hair. But anyway, I got to I gotta edit that video. Edit a separate video. I want to call it Dear 1992, 93, and 94. I might just I might just say, Dear 1993 Babies. I might call it that. And I gotta edit some other long form video. And I got, I gotta, I need to upload right now. As soon as I turn this off, I'm gonna upload all um, seven of my YouTube short videos. And then I'm gonna get out of work. And I'm gonna show y'all, I'm gonna show y'all how much time as a trucker, how much time we have in 34 hours to get things done. This shit crazy. I need to go buy the beauty supply store too because I broke my bunny. And I used to hate on black women with parachute bunnies, but now it feels so good. Like when I when I put on my little thin bunny that be in my house, I'm like, ugh, this don't even give life. Let me get myself together. I literally just pulled up to my job. The time now is 9.21. And it's still Beyonce birthday. Don't mind my friend texting me. Look at Kyle. I never seen a white man go through so many hair stages. It's funny. I guess they gotta switch it up too. I like your curly hair. Thanks. The, uh, it up. <laughs> you was going for that slick look. Oh, well, yeah. I had it nice and back and nice and tight. Wouldn't get in anything. And then... <laughs> and then I went to the Jewish hair. It always comes out. Jewish. It's still blonde. Yeah, right. Alright. Everybody needs to do good? I need a boost. Boost? Yeah, for my car. Can you help me out? I got my own jumper cables. Okay. Thank you. I've been having my car for two years, and now I want to act a fool on me. Life, life. I got, I got so much going on. Like my car should have been acting a fool on me before I got my mortgage. I ain't even got nothing to say. But Kayla knew that though. I don't even know why she tripping. For real, for real. So yeah, uh, I'm finna do a countdown. My bad, I'm tripping. Um, hey Siri, what time will it be 36 hours from now? It's tomorrow at 9.24 p.m. 9.24 p.m. 9.24 p.m. Hours. What time and day will it be 36 hours from now? It's tomorrow at 9.25 I just wanna make sure. 
I'm gonna do a countdown. It's already the fifth. I don't know why these apps are always asking to use our location. Like, bro, these countdown apps be doing the most, bro. Okay. Thank you. Like parking in the front, it'd be too many nosy people. Now I gotta wait on the person who just left with the courtesy car to come boost my um. Uh... You know what was weird? That mechanic, he been. You know what? I ain't gonna talk about him because he saw me on. He saw this recording, and you just never know who may look you up. I try to see if you're talking about them. Yeah, because I don't need beef with um the mechanics here. They do. <sighs> they do sort of kind of control my life. Let me find another countdown app because that last countdown app, baby, they, I hate, I hate all these apps that want hella fucking premiums. Like, bro, calm down. Then I ain't even look at how many people done downloaded it. 10K. And a previous downloader, a previous countdown that I had, a previous countdown that I downloaded at 185k and that's for a reason I see I need a new battery I'm probably I I think I'm not going to work Wednesday because I got a lot to do and I'm not fit up I don't like running errands and then I gotta go to work I be feeling rushed like nah I need I gotta go by Walmart buy two tires get them put on then I don't know who the hell gonna put on my battery I could get my brother to do it but I don't know it's cool when they do it. It's a problem when I do it. Fuck. A bird of a feather. Yeah, they pop together. These YouTube comments, they be so, um, they be so racist. Like, bro, you do not have to be on my page. But as soon as, um, people better not ever let me figure out how to trace IP addresses back to where people live at. These YouTube comments, they gonna hate me. They gonna report me. Cause child, I'm going in like no other. I was gonna be feeling it really a certain type of way. But I do love the encouraging comments. You know what? I need to be, I need to be putting my um, stuff in the car. So whenever I get ready to go, I can just leave. Uh, the time now is 9.32 and I'm going to let y'all know when the courtesy car get back and when they start doing whatever. Boy, these motherfucking mosquitoes, they so big and disrespectful, bro. Look at this big ass mosquito. You can't even see. Let me turn the air off. Look at this big mosquito. Oh my God, bro. Y'all must be sitting in here. Damn, fine mosquitoes, Lord. And then as soon and then they came as soon as I turned the air off. So it's 951. My car started. And um I'm gonna go to the beauty supply store. I don't understand how bitches be stealing from the beauty supply store. Well, I can understand in larger areas where you just wanted something. Nah, fuck that. Fuck that. Cause when people be cause when cause when women be stealing from the beauty supply store, it's always like one week. If I'm gonna be stealing. I'm getting a basket full of shit. You feel me? I'm not fit to. I'm not fit to get my picture put on the wall just for one week. That is just. That's just not happening. I told my car if she starts for me, I'm gonna uh, buy her a battery, and I gotta buy my good battery. I mean, I was gonna do that anyway, but I was just hoping she would start for me. And then I can't find my key. I'm gonna be so mad. I'm gonna be so mad when I go back to work Monday, I mean Tuesday, cause it's stinking there. It smell like tacos and shit. And I understand, where the fuck did he go? My porta potty in there making it smell like shit, but I gotta empty it. My mom be saying I'm nasty, but I feel like I'm not nasty. I feel like when I'm depressed, that's my mood. Man, the time before last when I went home, I had, uh, I had a mosquito bite me on my back, bro. Like, they so, they so disrespectful. I probably can't drive like this with this big ass iPad. Boy, if a state trooper see me, he gonna be like, oh, hell no. It's cool when they do it. It's a problem when I do it. Fuck them. Birds of a feather. Yeah, they fly together. 
I love Finesse two times. I love that he out of jail. I don't too much care for him signing to Moneybag because Moneybag signed to another nigga. This, I feel like Yo got is signed to somebody else. So I'm back. The time now is, I ain't even take my phone in there. 10.06. I'm for the drive. That means you might walk. I'm for the drive home. And... I just got me some Keisha Cole bonnets per. I seen somebody clowning her on TikTok, but girl, boo, I'm for the I'm for the rock these, baby. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna update y'all when I make it home. So um, I made it home. The time now is twelve twenty six. Still Beyonce birthday. My neighbor, I don't know who the fuck this is, but they standing like they waiting on me to get out of the car. Fuck is y'all looking at? I don't know, like. My town, so I visited my, uh, ooh, let me get my stuff at the background. I visited my best friend. He lived in Vicksburg, Mississippi, which is like two hours from here. And him and his brother, now his brother was like, is it weird that you don't know majority of the people in your town no more? And I was like, yeah, because I was just telling my mama how we don't know, we don't even know the dogs anymore. Like my town is so small. We, everybody even knew the dogs and the cats. And now we don't know nobody. And I literally do not know these people that stay next door to me. And it's low key pissing me off. But um, anyway, let me let me go in the house because they go watch me either way. Let me go in the house, get myself together. It is now 12, 18. Somebody went out to the car now. What the tag say? They from Alabama. Yeah, they don't know them and they don't know me. Fuck it. What's up, what's up? It is now 12.43. Still Beyonce's birthday. <laughs> and right now, I'm in a tub full of bubbles, but I don't want the camera too low to where YouTube bans me because it's too much cleavage because I do have big watermelons. I feel like real run. God is love, Rev Run right now. Do y'all, wait, if you used to watch Run's house, I think it was Run's house. If you used to watch Run's house, like at the end of the episode, he'll be in a big tub full of bubbles. <laughs> and then he'll be typing in his Blackberry. I never had a Blackberry. I missed the whole point of error because those were the shit I heard. Anyway, he'll be typing in his Blackberry and then he'll say some encouraging words and then he'll end it with, God is love, Rev Run. <laughs> I think that was a smart move of him to to become a, a preacher, a reverend. They make a lot of money. They get a lot of things exempt. It's so weird. I just found out that Donald Trump, I probably shouldn't even be saying this. They probably gonna take this video down. The orange man, that's probably even worse. He buried his ex-wife on his land and basically told the United States of America that this is a cemetery and when you have a cemetery on your land, a lot of things get exempt. It's always cracks in something. Always cracks somewhere that only white people know about. And by the time black people find out about it, white people done moved on. They done just made it harder for the Knicks. Shit crazy. I wish my window can open up. This shit will hit different. I should get a window price. I don't know. I don't need nobody breaking in in my house through the... The bathroom window and i did not fart because somebody be in the comment section when i be in my truck in the truck make a loud noise somebody be in the comment section did you just hear that loud fart tell me you've never been around an 18 wheeler without telling me you've never been around an 18 wheeler stop playing shit i'm trying to do a countdown of when i was supposed to go back to work but if i'm not acting right tonight some 34 hours from now bitch you she me no they said 33 that still ain't right I need some old fancy skin. I love this stuff. Like, I never in my life, this ain't the lotion, but I never in my life have put on lotion on my face. My mama probably put lotion on my face, but lotion always made me feel icky. Like that shit just, this shit just, just wasn't it. And for Rihanna, for Rihanna to come out with something that everybody liking shit, that shit crazy. <laughs> Rihanna be running circles around bitches. For real, she, that's how, I feel like I'm supposed to be doing something else in life, shit. Cause it seems like when I'm just gliding in life, when I'm just doing me, it seems like everything just be going good. But then as soon as I add in other people, I'm trying to help them out and be friends and shit, she just, she just a little. I gotta focus on me. 
And everybody should be selfish with themselves. I'm not I'm not taking that for granted. I'm not I'm not downing it. Cause sometimes I feel guilty for not being there for people because I'm trying to look out for myself. There's so much going on. It's so much going on in this world today. And people just be having their own life. But I love my friends though. Like we be having our own life. But when we finally get together and chill, <laughs> we be man, the last time I was with my friend Akira. Her husband called her. She was like, no, nah, he was like, ain't no way you and Keisha been in nukes for six hours. I'm like, bro, we had to catch up, dog. We ain't seen each other. We ain't talk. When you ain't talk to your people, bro, you got to catch up right then and there. And I think I hit her up at the last minute, too. She had just left the gym. She was like, meet me at nukes. She was ready. Real for real. So I got another one of these things, and I just leave these at home. Okay, here we go. I was gonna say, dang, I'm probably using too much. You know when black people, when black people say a quarter, they really mean one of them, one of them big coins, one of them big dollars. I think it's a, it's a called a dollar. <laughs> That's what black people really mean, for real, for real. Ooh. I'm crazily. I'm crazily in a phase in my life where I don't give a fuck no more. <laughs> it's kind of scary. <laughs> Cause when I stop giving a fuck, ooh, it be nasty. That should be wild. That should be ridiculous. Real for real. I need to post TikTok. I don't know why everything I say all go viral. Like damn. Y'all be doing so much. Y'all so fucking mean. I mean, but god damn. I'm a, uh, and I did not fart just then, Jesus. I'm gonna get some mashed potatoes, not mashed potatoes, sweet potatoes. No, they're not sweet potatoes, they're yams. <laughs> I'm gonna get some yams, cabbage, my mom said some ribs and some cornbread, but I don't ever eat meat. <sighs> life, bro. Life be life, in, for real, for real. All right, I'm back, I guess. So, I got out of the tub, and now it's, ooh, 108. Hmm, I didn't know that blinks. Oh wow, I can't see it. Where did it go? Mm. But anyway, so if you looked at my last video, you would have seen that I went to the beauty supply store. This is a separate video, of course. And I just, I picked up a couple things that I needed. Some I didn't, but that's adult, that's adulting, it's okay. So I broke my bonnet like, I wanna say a week ago. Cause I think I got on the road that day. I broke my bonnet a week ago. I was hurt. Cause I have a lot of bunnies, but it's not like the parachute bunnies that I want. Let me show you. These little thin, good for nothing bunnets, these. You know what? People in other countries might see this and they probably think we're disgusting because everybody hates black people. Anyway, so I normally keep a bunny in my truck, in my car, in my brother house, my house, and my mom house. But these little thin bunnies, bro, like I gotta upgrade my life. Like I gotta have the parachute. And people was clowning Keisha Cole, but come on, dog. How y'all gonna clown a legend like this, bro? I got both. Girl, yeah. My favorite thing is cheetah print, but yeah. So now I gotta restock. And um, yeah, I used to talk about black women who would have, hold on. I used to talk about black women because I'm like, why is, why are these young ladies wearing these big parachute? I'm feeling it, Keisha, I'm feeling it. I'm like, why? Why are these young ladies wearing these big parachute bunnies? And child, when I say, it just feel good. This is nice. <laughs> this is nice. Do you hear me? This is nice. I just heard something. Ooh, this is nice. And I like to wear mine crazy like this. Like, yeah. <laughs> but, um, okay, next, next item. I always wanted one of these, so 
Yeah, and then I showed y'all this. I got the black one, because, you know, she the print is my favorite, but, you know, you should always have black. Always. I'm going to keep this at home. I'm, I'm taking this on the road with me, keeping this at home. Yeah. Oh, and this is my favorite. This is oils. This is called black women tight. Ooh, this is for hair. This is this is called tea tree willows. I, I'm a sucker for these bottles. This is called pussy type, and I think I got pussy type in my room. Hold on, huh? I do. So now I have two pussy types. Lashes, of course, and lip gloss. This is the best lip gloss. Like I've been, I don't know what's wrong with me. I've been a crackhead for these. I wasn't even a lip gloss girl. Like I was a I was a mat matted person. I like matted. I didn't like gloss, but this, this don't leave no residue. It's called Hermine. <laughs> Herman. Herman, 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 Herman. It is now 147 of, what am I doing? Of the 34 hour break. Yeah. And I'm gonna go to my mom's house. I'm back at my house, 302. Still, it is still Beyonce's birthday. Yep, there it is. Let me see what Beyonce doing for her birthday. Oh, you lying? Why would they be doing for their birthday and stuff? Beyonce so full of shit. Where the birthday pictures at? She be trying to enjoy life and stuff. Ain't nobody ask you to enjoy life. Just drop the album. What's wrong with you? Let me look on Twitter. Beyonce birthday. Nothing, still nothing, girl. So it is now 3 13, and I'm gonna lay it down. And we're back, um, 5 11. Still Beyonce's birthday. I should be asleep, but I'm going down rabbit holes of people. Damn, damn, damn. I've been up since 3 20. The time now is 4 51. Okay. And it is not Beyonce birthday no more. And I don't know what time I'm supposed to make the work. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a calculator. The time now is 11:58 and it is not Beyonce birthday no more. So basically right now we passed the uh, we passed the um the 24 hour mark. So I mean I got we're gonna get our work about nine or something. And it's 12. The time now is, ooh, 108. And, um, yeah, y'all gonna have to believe me. Nine. So, I was supposed to be back at work like two hours ago. It's now 10.54, and I'm supposed to be back at work at like 9 or something. It's life. So, I just said that it was 10.54, 10.55, and it's not Beyonce's birthday, September 5th. Um, what else? I just came from my own club as previous videos you can see but yeah 34 hours is not enough time like i'm literally getting ready for bed getting ready for my bed 34 hours is not enough time and tomorrow i'm probably not even gonna go to work because i got stuff to do and couldn't do it because beyonce birthday was a holiday that's really a bar because mm. technically it was it was labor day but it was also beyonce birthday <sighs> Well, yeah, that's, that's it for this. What's up? I'm editing. So, I was trying to show y'all that taking a 34-hour break isn't enough for truckers. But, obviously, I had a lot going on in this video. If I get another trucking job, I'm going to redo it to where it's going to be correct. It's going to be the correct hours in an entire 34, not the 24 that I did in this video. <laughs> 
Um, I hope y'all enjoyed my timeline and uh, thanks for watching. <laughs>